Oh, this is incredible! This device will be your best ally against kidney disease. Catherine here, in this video we are going to test on myself some of the most powerful natural remedies for kidney disease. And we are also going to see a very innovative device that could make a lot of difference for those wanting to stop CKD. Oh, you won't believe how helpful this small thing can be! And I will use it to test these remedies. What we will have here is here hibiscus tea, which is known not just for its powerful antioxidant properties, but also as a way to lower blood pressure naturally. Oh, I love hibiscus tea because it's a tasty way to keep blood pressure in check without any side effect. Just like garlic here, this is probably my favorite as it has an incredible list of known benefits, including the property of greatly lowering blood pressure. You just need to prepare it the right way and it will change your life. And some more. What I want to show you is how powerful their blood pressure lowering and kidney repair potential actually is. Yes, my idea is to do something like what I did in my video about garlic peels. And by the way, not all garlic peels work, but some definitely do. And today we have more remedies to test that maybe are even more powerful than garlic peels. Before we get in depth into the remedies of today's video, a question. Why should you care about high blood pressure? Guys, if your goal is to stop or reverse the progression of CKD, finding ways to lower blood pressure naturally is a must. Almost every single kidney patient needs to take a blood pressure medication every day or even two or three times a day. Unfortunately, several recent studies are now linking regular use of the most common blood pressure medicines including ARBs and ACE inhibitors to kidney damage. Yes, as incredible as it may seem, the most used medicine to protect the kidneys are now found to be unsafe for the kidneys. This is really frightening. It's like someone told me that when changing oil to my car, the car repair guy will now put sand in the oil. But this is not about my car, it's about my kidneys. So frightening! So, the need for remedies that can help you lower your blood pressure naturally, especially when paired with improved diet and lifestyle, has never been as great. This is why we are here today. And by the way, I also want to focus on a new way of keeping blood pressure under control. In this box you see here, there's a very innovative device that will make a lot of difference when fighting high blood pressure. Imagine being able to check your blood pressure at any time of the day, whenever and wherever you need, without having to go to the doctor or even to undress. Is that even possible? Let's see. Let's unbox it. I just got this in the mail. I believe that it probably will be interesting for you. This company called Wearwiz contacted me and asked me if I wanted to review their smartwatch. Well, I don't do tech reviews here, I thought. But this is not your usual smartwatch. It has a unique feature that may be really interesting for anyone who needs to manage their blood pressure. Let's take a look. This unique smartwatch comes with an integrated inflatable air cuff so it can accurately measure your blood pressure. Incredible, isn't it? Yes, the watch band actually inflates to measure your blood pressure, just like the blood pressure monitor you probably already use, either at home or at your doctor office. And it will tell your blood pressure instantly, but it will also log it in the app, which is really, really useful. This way, you will be able to see if perhaps your pressure gets too high during a specific part of the day or maybe during the night. 
This could point out if perhaps a certain food or beverage is spiking your blood pressure or maybe will let you individuate an unexpected source of stress. Yes, in theory, this device could change your life. Now, today is all about testing. We are going to answer one question. Can a smartwatch be an accurate way of measuring blood pressure? To answer this question, I will be testing it against my trusty blood pressure monitor to see if it's accurate. So let's start with that. Now, the way this watch works is very easy. You just wear it like a normal smartwatch. The only tip here is to tie the wristband the correct way. You see, this comes with a very useful measuring tape that you put on your wrist and that will tell you how tight the watch band should be. Here, mine is the second hole. Now, I will not just measure once, I will measure three times. This is because, as you may already know, blood pressure is not always accurate at the first reading. And many people don't know this, but this is why doctors are supposed to measure your blood pressure two times, once at the beginning and once at the end of an appointment. So if your doctor does that, here's the reason why. If they don't, well, they should. It's also important to keep the right position when measuring blood pressure both with this watch or with a blood pressure monitor. You should be sitting in a chair with a back support and with your feet on the floor. You should be relaxed and keep the band at the same height as your heart. So let's see if this smartwatch is as accurate as my old trusty blood pressure monitor. I'm going to do three measurements with each and we will have the answer. So here are our results. As we can see, this smartwatch definitely works. I mean, I'm getting values really close to what my blood pressure monitor says. Okay, I must tell you that I was skeptical at first. This watch seemed too good to be true, but it works and it's able to track also your daily steps, your sleep and your heart rate. It comes with a very well-made app that lets you keep track of all those parameters. Now, if you are interested in it, this is available from wearwiz.com and also there is a link down in the description where you can get a discount. So check it out if you are interested in a device that lets you know your blood pressure automatically and accurately during the day. And guys, keeping track of your blood pressure is something you absolutely need to do even without this smartwatch. Well, I usually recommend is to use either an app or an old school personal health journal. Every day or at least weekly, you write down your blood pressure and the other important levels such as blood sugar, body weight, and so on. This is, in my opinion, the most important good habit when it comes to improving kidney function. This is something I personally do every day. It's a good habit everyone should embark on because it is something that can change your life in a matter of weeks maybe days. You see, keeping a health journal is something that can actually decrease your need for medications. Because for example, the combined benefits of garlic and hibiscus tea are impressive when it comes to lowering your blood pressure. If you can leverage them to lower your need for medications, the results will be really incredible. Now guys, if you want to know more about how to keep a health journal, my video up here is for you. Okay, sorry guys, but I wasn't able to test the remedies on myself at this time. I've been having low blood pressure for the whole week and as you can see, my blood pressure is still too low to take the remedies. This is not unusual for me, but this time it got so low that I wasn't feeling safe taking remedies that are known for lowering your blood pressure. But I will definitely be trying again, probably I just need to drink more water and to eat more salt. Yeah. In the meantime, if you want to know more about what really works to lower blood pressure according to science, my video up here is all about vitamins, remedies, and good habits to keep blood pressure under control naturally. And this is all for today. Thank you for watching.